Inside this 30,000 square foot facility in Wareham, the sounds of sewing has become synonymous with a certain family name. Welcome to Sperry Tents. We're primarily in the wedding business, but we, you know, we'll, we'll tent any event. Tim Sperry is the president of this family-run operation. It all started in the early 70s when Tim's dad, Steve, set sail to make, well, sails for sailboats. And by the end of the decade, the senior Sperry plotted a new course of direction for the company and decided there was another purpose for his massive amount of material. He could craft event tents. It was partly to fill in some time in the winter when things were slow, but it was also my dad saw a need. Steve's vision was not only to build a new company to fulfill a need, he wanted to create a bit of Camelot for his customers. I still enjoy watching people walk under him for the first time. They usually look up and are uh, suitably impressed and have that feel like this is going to be a, a special event. Make no mistake, these are not your average PVC pop-ups that the more conventional tents are made of. These are constructed of real sailcloth that's been treated to be fire safe and waterproof. This is multiple layers of fabric that, that uh, radiate out from the corner to spread the load out just like you would in the corner of a sail. On average, the team at Sperry cranking out more than 60 of these tents a year. They're in the middle of making the biggest tent we've ever made, which will be 66 feet by 166 feet, roughly 10,000 square feet. And with a robust wedding season scheduled for 2022, Tim says sky's the limit. We're building tents as fast as we can make them. There's a lot of demand for outdoor events right now. That demand is not just locally. Sperry has opened up a manufacturing facility in England to serve the European market. They've also shipped tents as far away as New Zealand and Australia. Oh, and by the way, on a side note, the Sperry family still making sales. That operation is located in Marion. I'm Doug Meehan, WCVB, New Center 5. I was gonna